everybody, welcome back to Lando Plays MC. Uh, feels like it's been a while since Buffalo did a video, like a real video of me speaking and stuff. Because the last video I made, it's a little, little weird. E. No, I was in a weird mood. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but for a lot of people that I know, iPods are starting to make a comeback. And I don't just mean the iPod Touch, which is so far the only non-discontinued iPod that Apple is still manufacturing. Uh, but yeah, iPods are making a comeback. Um, even though Apple officially uh, made the last generation of iPods, the iPod Nano um, 2015, and then they discontinued it officially in 2017. But like, why do people want iPods if your phone could play music now, which is probably the reason Apple discontinued the iPod in the first place. Um, for me, I think iPods are better because like iPhones could stretch out your pants pockets and the new wireless earbuds, you have to be at a certain limit and the wired earbuds, you know, it just makes it look clunky and you have those constant notifications that come up on your phone that you know, pause the music and yeah, all, all that, all that stuff. For me, uh, and a lot of my friends, the specifically one gener one type of iPod is making a comeback. And that is the iPod Nano. Specifically, the iPod Nano 6th generation and the iPod Nano 7th generation. Right here with me, I have the uh, iPod Nano 4th generation. Right here, I can't turn it on uh, because ow, it only works for a charger for some reason. I don't really know what the problem is. If you know the problem, then please, please tell me. Um, but yeah, and right now I have my personal iPod, the iPod Nano 6th generation. Uh, the reason it's pink is because it's my mom's and also I don't know if you could see it that good on camera, but um, it's broken. Yeah, it's weird. You can't see it on camera, but yeah. Also, my brother has the iPod Nano 7th generation. Go shout out to um, Just Bodie. So since the 4th generation isn't really making that much of a comeback, um, I figured I'll show you that first and then save the best for last. So, right now, wow, my clock is dirty. So, right now, I have the iPod Nano, and I don't know why. It only works, turns on, if you plug it into something. Uh, I can't find the charger right now, so I'm going to use this clock that I have. And see, it's starting to turn on. It's also pretty dirty. Let's give it a sec. Okay, look, the second to last iPod uh, with the click wheel. Um, so yeah. Um, music, it's really not to say, it's kind of like your standard iPod, but with a gyroscope and stuff. I can't demonstrate that now because it's on a clock. But, um, yeah, all that stuff. Plus it has uh, alarms, calendars, clocks, and also one of the last iPods to have games. Uh, Vortex, personally one of my favorites. It's kind of like uh, the breakout from the iPod Classic. But yeah, let's start a new game. See, it's a pretty cool design. I'm just gonna wipe that away. Time to beat. So here is the See, right now, it's uh, pretty cool. See, though, uh, immediately after I take it off, it just shuts off. And you may write in the comments, oh, it's probably dead. But I literally left this on the charger. Uh, max I've put it on the char I've left it on the charger is five days. But yet, it always doesn't work when I take it off the charger. So if you have, like, if you know the problem with it, please comment down below. Uh, but yeah, this one is... Pretty broken, 
and uh, we don't really, or uh, I don't really use it anymore. And again, the best for last, iPod Nano, sixth generation, my favorite iPod Nano. It's the only iPod to have touch only controls, which is pretty cool. As FM radio uh, settings with like clock face and stuff, people use it as watches, um, news and music. Uh, let's go to um, artists. So, hang on. Let's go to song. Nope. Sorry, I'm doing this one with one hand. So, like, you could scroll down and stuff. It may not seem impressive now, but in my opinion, it's a cool feature. And you press and hold anything, it brings you back to the home menu, which is pretty cool. I've seen a lot of posts saying the iPod Nano is dead because it was released about mm, almost, almost nine years ago, actually. But, uh, yeah, I totally recommend it. I think it's a lot better, a lot whiter, lighter than having a phone. And, like, especially the iPod Nano 6, it's a lot lighter. And it has a clip. So I'm just going to clip it onto my shirt, and bam. It's really light. So, yeah, definitely recommend iPod Nano in 2020. Uh, before I finish this video, though, I just want to tell you guys that my next channel, Ninlando, I'm going to post my first video this week. Uh, yeah, I'm having a second channel, mainly for gaming and Nintendo talk. Uh, but yeah, having my next channel, Ninlando, launching, and I want you guys to go check it out. Uh, and I'll show you guys it in the next video. Alright, see you guys later.